So uh, what we're showing here is a uh, TIO map board uh, with PowerVR SGX graphics in and um, what we're showing is um, a number of image processing operations on the image here, sharpness changes, brightness changes, contrast changes, saturation changes. Currently we're running in OpenCL. So this is running on the GPU, so we're using the GPU for general purpose computing. And you'll see that the CPU loading is very, very low. We also have a uh, frames per second here that we're achieving. So this is around 43.8 frames per second. Another interesting thing to note is we look at the power supply, this is measuring the power drawn by the whole board, the board as a whole, so obviously a 5 volt power supply, currently at 730 milliamps. What I'm going to do now is uh, change the demo over to run on the two CPU threads within the uh, OMAP device. And what we'll see here is that the CPU threads are now saturated, so we don't have any uh, processing power left within the cores. The frames per second has dropped significantly from where we were before at over 40 to uh, well under 30 at 26. And most interestingly as well, the power is now around, um, so we're now drawing around 930 milliamps. So this means that that's uh, 200 milliamps more than we were before with the GPU. And uh, I can just go back to that. So that's one watt more power. So in effect, we're drawing more power. We have lower performance. We've saturated our CPU cores. So it's a very, very compelling case for you know, doing GPU compute.